Good morning, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. The next bill, just picked it up yesterday, 1987 Box Chevy Caprice Classic. This is the LS. This is the one that has all the options in it. When it came with the leather interior, got the leather interior in there. You see the sun, the headroof got to be done, headliner. Seats got to be done. Dashboard got to be done. But this is the one that came with everything. It has the power windows, power door locks, the power seats. Let's see. Interior not too bad. But, yeah, we're going to take all this out. All this going to get gutted out. We're going to go completely back through the whole thing. And we got to get the top redone. And, actually, this one right here came with the 305 in it. 305 V8, so it don't make too many horses, but it's a few upgrades you can do to it to be able to actually make it get you a little bit of power. You probably can get it close to, I don't know, about 380 horses, maybe maybe 400. That's the max you're probably going to get out of it, but we're thinking about switching this one out, putting the LS in it. But this is just day one. You know, we're charging the battery up, see if we can get it started so we can get it off the trailer. But we're going to go all back through it. Actually, it's a one-owner car. Single owner car, bought it in 19, uh, 1987, matter of fact. Got the title to it. Bought it in 1987. Uh, he's the only owner. Car has 91,000 miles on it. I'm going to show you the odometer real quick. Watch it. One owner car. Like I told you, you got to power everything in there. Let's see if you can see the odometer right there. 91,973 miles. Man. Yeah, we can't wait to get started on this one. This one, we actually going to see how much money we can put into it to make it look like something. You know, we're going to start the videos, and we're going to go from beginning all the way to end so you guys can see the progress of the bill. But definitely, not a bad shell to start with, and this is the one most people want because it's the LS, so it has everything that you're actually looking for. So that way you don't have to try to get the door panels and get all the stuff wired in for the power windows and the power door locks. You got everything you need. It's already here. So that way all that stuff, we can go back through it, make sure everything works. But absolutely, this one right here is going to be a good bill. So just stay tuned. Stay tuned to the channel. And then make sure you like, subscribe. And then that way you guys can follow up with me. And then you can see all the videos I post so that you can actually see the progress on the car. But yeah, we're charging the battery up right now. But like I told you, came with a 305 in it. Got AC, I mean, it's, the car has everything you can want in it. So we definitely gonna get it back running, see what the motor run like, and then see if we can get it all switched out, see if we can put the LS and all that stuff in there and see how it run. But the 305 is not bad. We might just run that first just to see if um you know if we can get a few horses out of it, you know might be a nice car to run around town go ahead and get the interior done get the paint done get all these pieces and stuff replaced on it get the suspension done uh just change everything out see if we can make it run like a good car but honestly with ninety one thousand miles on it and i spoke to the owner he said he put a brand new uh transmission in it from gm and he said he spent about 1200 bucks on that to put the brand new transmission in. he hadn't even drove it too much after that so we're going to see what the outcome is. Just make sure you stay tuned to the channel. Like and subscribe. Appreciate you guys watching.